delicious carrot cake with frosting. For those who love cooking, it's a great option. And for the ones who not, try it! It's not difficult and you will have a great time, I promise. I've chosen this recipe because this summer I went to England and I discovered that it was marvelous and I loved the flavor, but I didn't really have a chance to cook it until today. The ingredients we will need for making this fabulous carrot cake are For the cake, 4 medium eggs, 150 grams of brown sugar, 150 grams of carrots, about 3 carrots, 75 grams of extra virgin olive oil, 150 grams of plain flour, 8 grams of baking gist, a pinch of salt, 1 teaspoon of cinnamon powder, and 50 grams of roasted and chopped hazelnuts. And for the frosting, you will need 200 grams of cream cheese. You can use Philadelphia type, but I'm using mascarpone because I love the flavor it gives to the cake and it makes it so smoothy. Also, you will need 125 grams of icing sugar. I'm using brown sugar to make it, but if you want the frosting to be white, I recommend you to use the white one. But I'm using this because it's better. And we also need 50 grams of butter at room temperature, and I'm using with uh, lacto-free because my mother is intolerant. And the last thing, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, and I'm using pro, va pro vanilla, and for that, I um, I will use like a bit less than one teaspoon, and then I will show you how it is. The kitchen tools we will need are a removable and round baking tin of 20 centimeters in diameter, a spoon, one spatula, the oven, the fridge, a teaspoon, and the last thing, whiskers. So let's start cooking! Peel and grate the carrot. Reservation. Frosting. We have to mix all the ingredients until we get a homogeneous cream. It is very important that the butter is at room temperature because if not, it will be not smooth. I'm gonna put the mascarpone, now the butter. As you can see, it smells so good. Now we have to let it cool. Frosting has like caramel color because it has brown sugar. decorate with some hazelnuts or chocolate the top part. It looks really great with the frosting on top. Now my sister's gonna taste it. Can you taste it, Maria? Okay. Enjoy 
great and I invite to you to make it at your home. It's great for not getting bored in this quarantine. And my last message for you is, stay at home.